Good morning you guys, welcome to today's vlog. Today is going to be a very chill hangout with me style kind of video, which I'm very excited for. If you can tell, my eyes are looking a little glossy underneath today because Jordan will be four months next week and he is currently going through his four month sleep regression. So I'm running on very little sleep and very little energy. So I had to cover up the bags this morning. Other than that, things are going really well with him. He's growing, he's rolling over, and I'm just really enjoying this time with him right now. Today's video is going to be all about fall foods and drinks. So a very fun tradition that I have is every fall I love to indulge in all of the pumpkin and apple goodness. I am going to be spending the day with the girls. I'm going to get out of the house, get away from the boys, and just have some girl time. I'm going to spend some time with my sister and my brother's girlfriend. We are going to go to Starbucks and try all of the fall pumpkin drinks. And then we're also going to go to Target and Trader Joe's and stock up on all of the pumpkin yummy snacks and try some new things, get some favorites that we like that we've gotten in the past and just have a really fun day. So I am currently in the middle of getting ready right now. I have to finish getting ready, get the boys squared away. My sister's going to be here soon. So I'm going to finish doing that and I will check back in with you guys in a little bit. Yeah. I'm going to get a call because I have a pumpkin spice frappuccino. <laughs> you have an apple crisp macchiato. And I have a pumpkin spice latte. Okay, let's all try. Oh, oh, cheers. cheers. <laughs> Dude, I need a straw for this. I'm so dumb. It's a lot to drink. <laughs> That's so good. It's so apple y. Yeah, this is not bad. Just super pumpkin y. Okay, take two. There's some in a lot of. <laughs> This is really good. Out of 10, I'd probably give this like a six. This is heavily pumpkin, and I don't taste like a lot of coffee. Mm. I'd say mine's like a six as well. Okay. Super pumpkin. Looks mine's like a 10. <laughs> I got the best one. Yeah, you do. I'll take your straw. Oh, sure. Oh, what are you talking about? This is hella good. I like this one a lot. <laughs> <laughs> this is good too. Mm -hmm. and this just tastes very milky. Maybe I'm a psycho. I like milk. <laughs> this is pumpkin spice latte. I think this one's my favorite. Well, this one's my favorite for sure. Really I take this. You want to try that? 10 out of 10. Did she, did she try yours? You tried all of mine? No. That's my least favorite one. What's everyone's favorite? I love favorite? that one. The apple for sure. That one, but I also really love that one too. I'd say last. Are we second. swapping? Look. 
Okay, we are back home. We're gonna do a little haul. First, from Target, we got these Tate's Bake Shop pumpkin spice cookies. Then I also got these pumpkin spice Milano cookies. Then we got some Kodiak Power Cakes Flapjack and Waffle Mix pumpkin flavored. So I'm definitely gonna try those. Then my sister got this Moonlit Cottage chocolate cookie kit to do with Asher. Next up is Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's is my favorite. They had so many pumpkin things that I think I almost got one of everything. But we'll do a little haul. So first we'll start off with this pumpkin spice cream liqueur. My sister has actually tried this before and she liked it. She got it when I was pregnant with Asher so I couldn't try it. So this will be my first time trying it. And then my brother recommended getting this pumpkin brioche bread because he said he used this for French toast. So I'm definitely gonna do that. I got some Halloween JoJo's cookies for Asher. I am a huge fan of oat milk. So I got some pumpkin oat milk for my coffee. I got these pumpkin cereal bars for Asher. I got these Madeline cookies that look super yummy. I got some pumpkin streusel muffins. These pumpkin cheesecake croissants. These mini spicy pumpkin samosas. And lastly, I had to get the pumpkin cinnamon rolls. I'm gonna clean this up, put all of this away, test a couple things on camera with you guys, and then we actually ended up getting some wine too. We got this Esperl wine. I just saw somebody on TikTok talk about it. So we're gonna do this and some cheese and crackers and just kind of hang out and chill for the rest of the evening. So here's a little overview of everything we have going on, stuff that we're gonna taste. My sister got these pumpkin cranberry crisps and then she also got these pumpkin blonde brownies. This is how the board turned out. It's not the most aesthetically pleasing, but this is what happens when you have to unload, clean, and feed your baby, and wanna hang out and drink wine and eat some cheese and crackers. So this is what we have. I'm sure it tastes great. It gets the job done. It does. First impression, first impressions. Poor it girl, poor it girl. I do heavy pores though. Here, let me be a... Let me be classy today. Ooh, look, they got Sharkisha boards. <laughs> but what, what happened in no more video games, huh? Uh, I've been sitting here with Anthony and we just sit there. And oh. Right, and ladies. Cheers. So, how do we? Ooh, that's good. That's I good. like it. Usually, yeah, it's like not it. too sweet. I usually don't like white wine. I feel really like it's good. a good blend of like dry and sweet. So contender number one, we are gonna try these Madeline cookies. Why aren't you focusing? There we go, Madeline cookies. You want to you try? I don't really want to try. Can I start chugging it? Do it. Oh, they smell so good. Oh my goodness. Am I in this or no? I would, I would just like dip this in this. All right. Oh, it's so soft. That is good. Let's rate it. Wow. Out of 10 or out of five? Let's do it 10. I would say 10 out of 10. Oh <laughs> you were ready for that one. I was ready. This is so good. I got more flavor when I went into the middle, more of the mm -hmm. spice. I think it's a 10 out of 10 because the texture, consistency, is very soft, even blending of the spices, and it's not too sweet. Oh yeah. 10 out of 10, TJ. Yeah, I'd say 10 out of 10. Mm. We got these Tate's Pumpkin Spice Cookies. Oh, 
do. It comes in like a tray. Oh. First impressions. It looks like it's a uh, overbaked. Well, well, they're thin. I guess yeah. we'll be crunchy. Can you hear that? Hey, it's some more. <laughs> oh, they're not hard. <laughs> it's not hard, hard though. Like break teeth hard. The flavor is good. Mm -hmm. Really good. I would say like a six and a half. To me, this is like a seven or an eight. I would say yummy. Eight. What do we have next? Milano. Yeah, All the cookies. It's, it's, a little, nutty, it's like a little cheeseburger. Mm -hmm. I feel like these are gonna be a fan fave. This is what it looks like. Oh, I already bit my mouth. <laughs> She's here. <laughs> mm. It's chocolate and um. I feel like it's chocolate and like pumpkin spice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like two flavors. It's, I think it's good. Next up, we have these pumpkin Ooh. blondie brownies. Ash just asked me for a bite, so I ripped him a piece. There you go. Mm -hmm. I really You're welcome. That's what it looks like. Now let's give it a try. Oh my gosh, that's good. Now these are moist. Ooh. These are super moist. <laughs> <laughs> Next up are these pumpkin cranberry crisps that are on our charcuterie board. So we actually have blueberry cheese and jalapeno honey Why cheese. Why do you want that, baby? No, thank you, you can have some. So. so I'm gonna try it with the jalapeno honey. Blueberry vanilla chevron? I don't want to Fresh good cheese. Not cheese mm -hmm. is a 10 out of 10. Oh yeah, that Dude. cheese is really good. Especially with the cranberry on this. Okay, last up, we got this pumpkin spice cream liqueur. Cheers. That's strong. Ooh, are we supposed to shake it? Yeah, that's strong. Maybe we should have mixed it. It's good though. The yeah. flavor is good. It should, it, yeah, it is yeah, very enjoy strong. Enjoy it on the rocks or with a warming cup of coffee. And that is all for <laughs> our, ver or what is this? Like our session of taste testing. Is it good? Do you like it? Yeah, would you rate it um, a 10 out of 10, a 9 out of 10, an 8 out of 10? What do you think? 10? 10? 10, Asher says 10 out of 10 for the cookies. <laughs>actually changed into something a little more cozy I gave Asher a bath and we're actually going to be doing a Halloween activity today I'm doing a Halloween related activity with him every day this month I have a series going on on my Instagram right now where I'm doing 31 days of Halloween activities with him I actually have Asher sitting right here on the floor patiently waiting for me or impatiently waiting for me to close out this video so we can do it. I'm actually really excited. It's our first craft that we've done and we are making a puffy ghost. So if you want to follow along on that series and get some inspo to do some things with your kids, I will tag my Instagram handle down below. I actually got my last Instagram hacked and I no longer have access to that. I'm going to quickly get going now because he is super impatient playing with the toy and trying to get my attention. I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already and I will see you in my next one. Bye!